Welcome back to Let's Play 1000 Amps. We're reaching around the amp tree. And with any luck, we will find something to help us out. As soon as I figure out where I am and what I'm going what I'm doing. You can fall down there, that's not super helpful to me. There's a block there. I'm looking to get the room that's more or less directly above me. Okay, so I'm trying for this room, trying for this room. Be nice if I could see anything. Please work. Didn't work. That, however, will. Oh, great, now what do I do? Oh, there we go. Crap! Okay. Okay. We got, I got this. Ah! So my next goal is to jump down on that block. And then... Make it, and please be it. Yes. Yes. So how much of the outside here have I not gotten? Looks like I've gotten everything outside. Except for the one final room. And then looking through the inside, the only room that I have not gotten is... The one giant room there, which... I just know you cannot do until near the end of the game. Once you start cla climbing, clamming the tree. We encounter a couple rooms up at the top that we can't even reach. And then there's that room, which fudge that room. So... Let us continue on our journey and figure out what is the happening. Something happened there. I don't know what, but I'm thankful for it. Where's our light? Where's my light source? Just the one. All right. Guess I'll just ride my way up. This actually takes us out of the open exterior world and into the small path around the tree. And a lot of this is a one-way path, and on a lot of this we're very limited in what we can do. There's our one light. Growing out the top of the tree. There's another light in here somewhere. Probably going to be up top somewhere? Question mark? How in the world? Where is it? Aha! I found it! Oh, and you actually had to complete that one. You couldn't teleport up here otherwise. Have to use the vertical jump. Hmm. Well, looks like an interesting room. How do you work, Mr. Room? Crap. Crap. There we go. Alright. We, we still got this. Well, that's... that's pretty terrible. Um, by the way, those rooms that we just passed through... I'm pretty sure those are some of the worst rooms in the game, now that I'm remembering them. Because any time you want to do them again, you have to go all the way back around. If only for that backtrack, because there's no other way down.
We've got all these lights just growing out of the top of the amp tree. Only way to get that one is by jumping high enough. Actually, I can jump high enough from here to get it. Which should let me do all of the things that I need to do! That one just did the exact same thing. So twice now they've given me a room that I cannot complete. I could try that one over and over again, but I'm gonna wait a moment. There we are. Hey, it's not much, but whatever works. Hey. Hi, you're doing it to me again! I'm lost. I'm confused. Where's the light in that? There it is. Alright, we're good, we're good, we're good! Crap, 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 crap. I don't like being forced down a conveyor belt! Makes me nervous. Hey, we're working our way up there. And now we're above the top of the amp tree. Get just a little bit on the other side there. Let's dive down and see what's inside. All I need is one glow in this room. Hmm. We're back. We're back where we were first born. If you could call it being born. Pooh. Oh well, that's fine. Only no it's not. Because you have to do all that your first run through. That's kind of annoying. Well, while I'm here, let's go ahead and get, um... Let's go ahead and fill out the other room here. So we can get that one on map. Work our way down here and get this room on map. That was simple. And looks like that room there is the only one left for us to try before we have to backtrack all the friggin' way back up there. So that room is down one of these two passages. I chose correctly. And with that said, we've now actually mapped out everything except for this room and the annoying room over there. So I guess I'm just going to have to run my way all the way back around. Going to be great. Okay, let's try this one again. Preferably with less failing this time. Okay, I'm pretty sure there's three of them in here. So, for the last one, all I have to do is... Do that! All right, all right, making progress. Hey, and there's all of them for that. And that one is not there. How about over here? Hey. So that actually gets us the area around the center. And that will give us our power for the center. You'll notice we're glowing. 
And I don't recall us ever having run into a power node in this room. That is the special ability that we have gained. If you look back up top, the room is still dull and dark. This means that there was never a power node in there, but we still had full access to all power. We essentially have a permanently full bar. This. We are now generating our own power. So... That said, there's a couple things that we can do. I also believe, seeing as once you are at full power, you can teleport without sapping the life out of the blocks next to you, I'm pretty sure we can even now teleport without sapping the life out of adjacent blocks, despite that we maybe have not finished the room. No, 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 no. So, our next goal is to go back and 100% a lot of things. All the rooms that I have not yet accomplished, I'm pretty sure are all impossible to accomplish. There are the couple rooms going up over here, but seeing as you're on an upward dash and at the top, you're broken out of it. So you don't even have room to waver back and forth and get a few. You also can't teleport and it be of any use anyway. It's not enough. You need too many nodes. So getting a lot of these are simply impossible right up until now. And I want to say that's the same with that vertical room. So we can run back and we can do all of the things. So we just have to run way back, whoops, just have to run ourselves way back. Let's see here, this is the first room and it should be as simple as us dashing through the center. Saved, saved, saved! So much saving! If you didn't complete a room, this is a very easy way to complete said room. Kind of takes the fun out of it, though. But then the only rooms we have left are rooms that we couldn't have done anyway. I'm not sure if we have anything left to get or not. We'll find out. How about up here? Nope. Do believe that's all of them. You can see our path going all the way down and around. So that said, we do have one last little area to get things at, and that's the area that's just down here. And I do believe the only node in this room is this one, which you can't get to without the full glow. But we have returned to the top of the amp tree. Ah, oh, look at that. We were born right here, like, nine videos ago. And then even back around here, we can now go back and get that one room, which I don't even know if you got anything out of doing that room. I want to say not. I'm going the wrong way. I want to say that there was no reward in that room, other than maybe bragging rights. Okay, before I do anything stupid, how do I even get over there? Okay, so I go up over here. I work my way around. Over here, here we are. 
done. Up at the top here, you need like maximum glow to reach those. And even the one at the top there, hidden behind the one that you hit with your head, you need so much glow to be able to get any of those. Really, that goes towards our completion rating, but I don't think we got anything out of that. We are missing a seed, though. I'm pretty sure there's 25 seeds. Well, there's one last room for us. So we are going to go look for that last seed. Well, the last seed, I don't know. I don't know where it is. We're gonna go finish up the last room, though, that we couldn't do otherwise. And this is the room that we passed up a very long time ago. Sure it was! Heck yeah! I have all of the glow! Heck yeah. Look at that full battery. Durn tootin'. Alright, lady. Yeah, you done there? Because I got one last room to go in. Boop, boop. No, guess I'm going down here. Boop, boop. I don't know where I'm going! I'm going over that way, somewhere. Look at how much we reach! It's like the 5x5 five five area around us gets lit. And yeah, we can teleport without sapping the life of the nearby blocks. Oh, completion rating 100%. And that's everything. That is all of the rooms. That is only one seed that we're missing, and I have no idea where it is. The next video may be a little on the short side. But I'm going to hold on until next video. In that one, we will rid the tree of the cruel intruder. I'm also going to do this to give all y'all a chance to maybe tell me where that last seed is, because I don't know where it is. If you can tell me which seed I missed, which room it's in, I'm sure that's not going to help being, like, descriptive in telling me where it is. It's like, how could you even describe it? Oh well. Ballpark it as best you can if you happen to know where it is, and I will go get it. If not, then... Uh, I guess we just fight the dude and watch the ending next time. Until then, everyone.